ਵਾਹਿਗੁਰੂ ਜੀ ਕਾ ਖਾਲਸਾ ਵਾਹਿਗੁਰੂ ਜੀ ਕੀ ਫਤਿਹ ਸਟੈਪਿੰਗ ਸਟੋਨਸ ਪੀਐਸਐਲ ਪੰਜਾਬੀ ਰੀਡਰ 4A 2019 ਐਡੀਸ਼ਨ ਲੈਸਨ 5 ਵਿੱਚ ਤੁਹਾਨੂੰ ਜੀ ਆਇਆ ਨੂੰ ਲੈਸਨ 5 ਦੇ ਵਿੱਚ ਅਸੀਂ ਇੱਕ ਥੋੜਾ ਔਖਾ ਟਾਪਿਕ ਸਿੱਖਾਂਗੇ ਸਾਡੇ ਪੰਜਾਬੀ ਦੇ ਵਿੱਚ ਕੁਝ ਛੋਟੇ ਅੱਖਰ ਕਹਿੰਦੇ ਆ ਜਾਂ ਪੈਰੀ ਅੱਖਰ ਕਹਿੰਦੇ ਆ ਉਹਨਾਂ ਨੂੰ ਅਸੀਂ ਤੇ ਉਹ ਤਿੰਨ ਅੱਖਰ ਨੇ we have three consonants that are used as conjuncts or short sounds they are chhota ha ha chhota ra ra and chhota va va okay chhota ha ha is a ha ha we write at the bottom and then ra ra and chhota va va we are missing that here ha huh? let's see if we can write them let me get my annotation tool so here chhota ha ha would be like this and chota vava would be like this theek hai now what do they do the chota ha ha changes the meanings of the words it really makes new words chota ra ra changes the pronunciation of the words now we can write vada ra ra or chota ra ra the meaning won't change but it changes the pronunciation chota vava also changes the pronunciation of the words theek hai let's look at some examples so this word is kadi 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 is a chain like a link like a circle kadi is chain the kadi tut gayi hai when a necklace or a chain breaks that's the kadi okay now when we add a ha ha at the bottom we say kadi 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 Now, kadi is a dish, Punjabi dish, yummy, yummy. Kadi chawl khaoge and kadi is usually eaten with chawl. Okay? Pihle rangri hundi hai, dahi to bandi hai, which kai log pukode bhi pande ne. So, kadi is delicious. Jaga, jaga, jaga means light up. Light, jaan patti jaga, turn on the light, right? Jaga. However, when we put a ha ha at the end, at the bottom, we say jaga, 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 jaga is a place. Teri class which baton di jaga keri hai. Which chair do you sit in? Which place do you sit on in the chair, in, in the class, right? So jaga and jaga are different words. So that's the importance of peri ha ha, chota ha ha. it does change the pronunciation and the meaning of the word if we wrote whole ra ha ha here we'll say kadhi now kadhi does not make sense if we write the whole letter here ha ha we will say jagha right that won't make any sense so that's why we need to use the chota ha ha so what about chota ra ra now chota ra ra um it does not create new words if you use the vadda ra ra it will be fine it will be the same word but it's just how we say it for example this is pr prb prab 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 if we didn't have the chota ra ra we had full ra ra we will say parb parb right and that doesn't sound right so prab means god vaheguru da ik na prab vi ha then what about prabhu 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 means also god if we didn't have chota ra ra we had vadda ra ra we would say parbhu right parbhu is not a, not a, the right pronunciation so it doesn't change the meaning of the word but it changes the pronunciation prabhu vi vaheguru da na <coughs> sorry prabhu vi vaheguru da hi na hai so prab and prabhu are both vaheguru's names then prince 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 if we didn't have chota ra ra we had vadda ra ra we will say per parents parents right that won't be right so nobody likes to be called parents we want to call them prince prince sona na hai prince also means a a shahzada a son of a king then this one is amrit 
amrat, like sh short rara sound, right? If we didn't have short rara, we had whole rara, which many people write, it will be amrat, amrat, okay? So that's the difference in pronunciation. Amrat chako, khalsa saju. Amrat is also name of people. Many people name themselves amrat, which is a very sweet name. So chota baba, how about chota baba? <coughs> we don't use chota baba very often. But it is used in some words, especially Guru Gobind Singh Ji, when he wrote Gurbani, uh, he used a lot of Chota Baba in his uh, words. For example, one example is Tav. Tav, tav means Tera, means Rabda. Swaman, Swaman. Swaman means self-respect. If we didn't have Chota Baba, we will say Tav, which is fine. Or we will say svaman, 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 right? Which will be fine. It won't make a very big difference. Okay. Now let's read this little paragraph. It has some chota uh, letters in it. And let's see uh, what we need to do. Read with me. Okay. Sab lok vakri jagate bat ke pardehan chota rana. Chota ha ha, chota ha ha, right? Kai lok light jaga ke bistre vich pardehan. Jaga, remember? Uh, no ha ha, but with ha ha, it's a different word. Kai lok desk pe ate kai lok library vich jake. To see. किस जगह ते बैठ के चंगा पढ़ सकते हो? So think about it. Read this paragraph again to yourself later and tell which place do you like to read better? At home, in your bed, on a desk, in school, in library. Okay, for homework today, you will read these words, then you will copy these words in your best handwriting. Take it. And then you're going to read these feelings words, sentences, and you're going to copy them also. So this one says, and I'm going to teach you some new vocabulary here. Kudi ne sir rumal banya hai. Means she has tied a scarf on her head. Munde ne sir te pag banya hai. Munda has a pag. Kudi khush hai. Ladka vi khush hai. Kudi ate ladka khush han. Okay, they're both happy. Now, we use the word munda, munde, and we use the word ladka. They're synonyms. They mean the bo both of them mean boy. Okay, we use the word hai with one person. We use han with more than one person, plural. Okay, look at the word banni. Bunny has peri ha ha, chota ha ha. If we didn't have the chota ha ha, we'll say bunny. Bunny is like a little um, silhouette, little wall, right? Uh, so it's bunny. When we have chota ha ha, we say bunny, bunny, right? So that's the difference. So you're going to read these sentences again and then copy them in your best handwriting here. And that is our lesson number five. And I will see you very soon in lesson number six. Until then, keep on reading Punjabi every day. Uh, spend seven minutes, read a few words, write a few words, uh, memorize one line of Japji Sab. I think that'll be great. You will become such a smart, such a good reader in Punjabi. Vahiguruji ka khalsa, Vahiguruji ki fateh.